Good evening guys, welcome back to my channel Edinburgh's Honest Guide. As you can tell, I'm not in Edinburgh, I'm actually on the island of Tenerife and I'm here in Costa Deque and in tonight's video guys, I am going to review one of Costa Deque's best Indians rated by TripAdvisor. Now according to TripAdvisor, this place is five star. It's got five star reviews on food, service, but it's not your usual place you would think about going. Uh, I'm going to put all the details in the description below where you can find this place. But the name of this restaurant is called Bobby's Free. Now, they've got a couple of restaurants here on the island of Tenerife, but I'm here at the Costa Deque one, and I'm going to review it, mark it out of 10 guys, and you are going to join me to view the food to see if it's actually worth uh, coming here and enjoying a meal at Bobby's. As you can see behind me guys, the sun is just setting on the island of Tenerife. What a beautiful view here in Costa Deque. But I'm just going to crack on with the video guys and this is actually my first food review here on the island of Tenerife so I hope you enjoy. Uh, as I say, if you are new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel, click that bell for notifications and let's go. So guys, we're just walking up to Bobby's Free just now. It's just located if you know this place in Costa Deque, it's been Costa Deque and uh, Las Americas, it's basically between the two of them and it's just up this wee lane here on the right hand side. Bobby's free, nice wee place out the way, you wouldn't know it was here unless you looked it up but this has got five stars on TripAdvisor so we're going to go in there and mark the food out of ten and we're looking forward to this one. Hey guys, I'm just about to look at the menu and Bobby's free. It's an Indian tandoori, so I'm looking forward to this, but I'm just going to show you the menu right now. Okay guys, I'm going to show you the menu in Bobby's free just now. So this is the menu, it's quite a large menu. So we're going to look at the appetizers. Got poppadons with dips. Got your usual stuff there. You've got your salad and your soups. And then you've got your vegetarian starters non-vegetarian starters you obviously you got to start a main course cooked in an Indian clay oven then you've got your stuff here amazing thank you and then you've got your curries here guys you've got your chicken tikka lamb fish and then it gives you tells you how hot it's going to be so you get to pick your level which is good and then you've got your usual your korma your butter chicken you know what I mean, your Jeffries, all your all the fan favourites, and then you got chef specials as well. All your chef specials, butter chicken, and vegetarian dishes as well. As I say, this is quite an extensive menu. And you've got your rice guys, all your rice dishes there, your naans as well, cheese naan, butter naan, all your naans. Then you've got your kids menu, desserts, and then your drink menu guys, last of all. So I went for the Dorada. 240, which is here. Lovely beer. Mm. Can't go wrong with proper norms. Nice. You like it? <clears throat> Whoa. My mouth nail just came off. Holy shit. <sighs> For a small place. You know what I mean? It's these places that turn out the best. All your fancy restaurants cost money. There's more money into that restaurant. Oh, lovely. Thank you. Oh, that'd be brilliant. Thank you very much. Thank you. Wow, look, this looks amazing. Thank you very much. Thank you. That's the chicken pakora? Uh huh. And that's the onion badges? Yes. Wow. Have a look at the starter, guys. So, this is the onion badges, and this is the chicken pakora. Looks delicious. The onion badges look amazing. Ah, oh, can't wait to tuck into them. 
Right. Yeah. What you going? What you going for first? You going for badger? Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to go for chicken pakora first. Let's see how this baby is. Now it's not. It's not a lot of batter in it, like it usually, but that tells me it's been cooked fresh. Really nice. Real nice. It's coated in something too. Mm. Take a look at that guys. Nice fresh chicken there. Coated in I don't know what, but thin butter, not too buttery. Really nice. Hey guys, check this onion badger out. Looks like it's homemade. Looks delicious. I'm gonna try this out. Onion badger thing. One of my favourites. Mm. Good there. Eh? Good. Yeah. It's different to what you get back home. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. It's all processed stuff back home, but this feels like it's been cooked fresh. It well, soft. yeah, aye, yeah. it's soft. There's a lot of onions in it. Mm -hmm. I think it's nice. I'll put some uh, dip on it. It's the best thing. I think that's what it's missing. It's just missing like chilli sauce on the side. Mm. Like a dip. Mm -hmm. That's what it's missing, a dip. Mm -hmm. That's lovely, thank you. Very good, thank you. Thank you, my friend. Mm. Oh, I forgot to mention mm -hmm. that just now they're offering 30% off. So if you give them a phone, they message you on WhatsApp, to confirm the booking and you get 30% off. You can also book on TripAdvisor as well, where you also see the 30% logo there and you just book through the app. It's easy and convenient. And then you just come down and enjoy your meal. Right guys, the starters were really good. No complaints, the only one thing I would like to see in a dip with the badges and the chicken pakora, a nice chilli dip or something like that, it never came with a dip, but there was enough flavour in the dish to be good enough without the dip, but I'm a bit old fashioned, I like a dip with my chicken pakora and onion badge. it just makes it a wee different, but that doesn't mean it's not good, it just means that I want a dip, <laughs> but uh, we're going to wait for our mains now. We've ordered the chicken korma and the butter chicken and a naan and a rice. And that's between two of us. Uh, and obviously we've got a couple of poppadoms and we've still got our sauces which are gorgeous. So I'm going to enjoy this beer just now until our main course comes out. Wow, thank you very much. Thank you. Butter chicken, lovely. Look at that, it smells good. It's brilliant. Thank you very much. Oh, Nan. Thank you so much. Wow, thank you. thank you very much. Thank you. Look at that, Nan. Wow. Guys, take a look at this. Right, so this is the chicken korma, and this is the butter chicken, and you've got your rice here, and the Nan. Look at that, Nan. Dripping with butter. Mm -hmm. I can't wait to tuck into this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I hope medium's not spicy. It will be. I usually choose mild, but today I've chose medium, so I like a wee bit of spice, but hopefully it's not too spicy. Use one for that and one for that. One, yeah, one for that, yeah. one for that. This is my one though. Alright, okay, alright, okay. Alright, okay. I get you. <laughs> Oh. 
nice and creamy. Eh? It doesn't look orange anymore because you asked for It's a hot lake. Right, let's tuck into this korma. Puree rice in different colours. We've seen that before. Quite a different taste than what you usually have. Yeah, spicy. Oh really? Uh-huh. That's why I said you're mild. But it's really nice. Mm -hmm. Got a nice flavour to it. And the chicken, oh the chicken's soft as hell. Absolutely delicious. Right, we're going to go for the butter chicken now. This is the butter chicken. Right, we're going to try the butter chicken now. The missus said it was gorgeous, so let's see if she's right. Wow. Not spicy as what I thought it would be. Mm. For me, John. It's actually really nice. There's a lot of flavour. Mm. Oh, definitely. Oh, I could eat the chicken. The chicken tikka. It's soft as hell. Mm, look how perfect that chicken tikka is. Absolutely delicious. I can see why this place has got five star. This lets me finish the meal. Uh, overall, that was absolutely delicious. What do you think of it, Mrs? Do you think it was good? Awesome. Awesome. She thinks it was awesome too, so she's happy. I'm happy. But we're going to pay the bill. And next time you see me, I'll be outside and I'm going to rate this out of 10 and let you guys know if it's worth the money here in Costa Deca. Right guys, I have just got out of Bobby's Free. Yes, Bobby's Free, guys. And I have had an amazing meal here on the island of Tenerife here at Costa Deca. This is Bobby's Free. They also have a Bobby's 2, which is in Players de Americas. So you can look it up on Google if you want to visit that one, if you're that side of the island. But this one, Totally amazing. Uh, I will say though, they do offer a 30% discount if you book on their website. Uh, that's what I did. Uh, you basically go through to WhatsApp, it takes you to WhatsApp, they send you a message, book a table, they confirm it. Simple, you'll get 30% off. Uh, I'm not too sure about walk ins. They did say to me that walk ins are not included in the 30% discount. But let's check the receipt. Now, look at this receipt. I'm going to put it on the screen just now, right? 34 euros and 17 cent. How amazing is that? 34 euros for basically a starter and a main course for two people. Absolutely amazing. You know what I mean? The Papa Doms was 3 euros, but I got 90 cent taken off that. 2 euro 10. Chicken pakora can. Oh, look at, look at that. The pint as well. The pint wasn't included in discount, just so you know. It's food only. But for 34 euro. This must be the cheapest Indian in Tenerife. What do you guys think? Absolutely had an amazing time here. You wouldn't think of it as like a restaurant to go to, but try these places. They're actually really, really nice. You know what I mean? I wouldn't think all these fancy places, they charge you more because they've got more to pay for. These places, it's got like, what, 12 tables in there. You know what I mean? It's absolutely delicious. Everything was cooked fresh. Couldn't fault anything. The only one thing that I would say, and this is going to be like with the mark I'm going to give it, will reflect what I'm just about to say. The only one thing is I never got a dip with my 
Baji or chicken pakora. So I would say I'm going to give it a 9.8 out of 10. A hard 9.8 out of 10. Only because of the dip. Because I'm used to having a dip, like a chilli dip and something like that. So like I'm going to give it a 9.8. I think that I think that's reasonable. I think it's one of the best Indians I've ever had. But you always get good Indians when you come here in Tenerife. You know I mean, it's always different food, different ingredients to what is back home. I just think it's better. I mean, I spend forty pound on a takeaway in an Indian back home. I got thirty-four pound. Gets me a meal out with the missus, and I actually really enjoyed it. So I can't fault it whatsoever, guys. But. I am going to end the video there guys, I've had an amazing time here at Bobby's Free, I am going for a couple of drinks now, maybe a couple of cocktails, uh, I'm not going to Veronica's tonight so there's no, that's not getting filmed. film but I just want to say thank you for uh, being here, being me through this journey, thank you for supporting me uh, and I'm going to end the video there so thank you for, uh, for watching, I'll see you next time guys, take care.